the name for our place is uh, the Waitemata in Moana. Uh, that is the biggest sea area. Uh, shining the Mata is the obsidian. So the Waitemata shines like the, the obsidian. Yeah, so this project in Akahu Bay really is around restoring the Modi of Akahu Bay. Uh, Modi for me is bringing people back into the water, being able to swim in the water, uh, biodiversity. Uh, so Modi is about life force. So clean water means lots of fish, lots of biodiversity, and our young people in there swimming every day. I think what motivates all of us in this project is just to make the ocean a better place, both for the animals that live in it, but also for us as humans that live around it and love it so much. This project is just a continuation of the wider project that was started uh, back in 2012 uh, by some of our whanau uh, and our, our sister, our late sister, um, Rochelle Kahui McConnell. 1914, the photo on the left hand side, is the beginning of the willing desecration. That is the construction of the sewer line that came from the industry and the hospitals of Auckland. Uh, the, the pipe that came through here with sewerage um, devastated our, our, our fishing grounds and our, our grounds for collecting um, kaimawana. This is what we are coming to right, the wrongs. And um, the aim is to land um, kutai or mussels onto those shells to help filter um, and restore the modi to our bay. So today we've got the last uh, 20 tonne of mussels coming into Okahu Bay. Uh, really, really exciting day to, to get them in the water. So happy to be here. Mahi rangatira, a kaupapa nui. Ngā mihi nui, kia koutou. Yeah, this is a really interesting and unique project because it's driven so much by Ngāti Whātua themselves. Um, so we've been brought on board to try and help, um, which is our goal in life. Um, but because it's so community and iwi driven for this local area, it's been really interesting because we can learn a lot about the history, which has been really interesting and also useful for us because learning about what's happened in the past makes us then try and understand what we can do to then bring this area to the future, to a better future. So mussels, kutai in particular, are a really cool species because we call them a keystone species or an ecosystem engineer. So they really help the whole system to work. And so by just putting down the kutai, it's not just the kutai, it's all these other animals that then become, a, get associated with the kutai. They live on them, they eat them, they live underneath them in the sediment. And they're all like little pumps, the filter feeders, they're going like this, chunk, 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 chunk. And they're, what they're doing is they're, they're sucking in um, water, looking for, for, for phytoplankton to get food out. And what that means is that they're cleaning the water. Is it's really a large scale experiment, uh, which will help us understand how to restore the mussel beds at scale. We can get cleaner water, clearer water, lots of new species coming back, lots of other species coming back bigger. So things like snapper, for example, they come back better because they can use these beds for um, nurseries. You know, when you look at this bed on its own, it, it might have a small impact on a small local impact, but if we get lots of them um, together out throughout the whole Hauraki Gulf, uh, you've got that um, cumulative action. Seeing bums in the air and hands in the sand collecting kaimoana, you know, that would be a beautiful health indicator. And I would love to think that within my time we will see that. In our karakia we acknowledge again uh, those that have passed on, uh, those that have contributed to the, to the uh, kaupapa. So many people have put time into this project and they are not here and it's like our duty, our duty to honour those who have put in all those years for this and to honour our people and for those who lay in our urupa, our local urupa, it's our duty. So my heart is warm that my mokopuna will see our example for their future too.